Hey, welcome back to Trinity Productions website. Hey, today um, we've got just a short video um, showing you how we are making up uh, frontline, backline um, stage stringers for power. So um, what we're going to do is show you the, the boxes that we have found. Um, to do that with a very professional rubberized box and uh, show you how uh, we are putting those together with uh, some uh, 12 gauge uh, SOW cord um, that uh, is um, almost kind of bulletproof. So anyway, um, hang on and we'll be right back. Okay, so now I've got the, um, the cover that we're using for the boxes as well as the boxes. Um, we have picked these up from, and I don't know if you can see it here, we'll get the light on there, from OA Windsor. And uh, we'll give you the web address for this um, on the, the website um, and not in the video. But um, give Ken at OA Windsor a call. Um, he will set you up with these sweet little rubberized boxes. Um, this model happens to be one that will take a, um, a half inch cable, uh, 12 gauge in each end of the box. Um, and then also uh, mounting for a uh, duplex receptacle um, on each side of the box. And that's where it comes in with this um, nice rubberized plate that once the uh, box is together and the plates together, that um, this forms a, uh, a very nice assembly, um, which I will show you. So this is the completed assembly. Um, you can see that we've got the, uh, the half inch cable um, into each side. Again, this is 12 gauge. Um, power loss down this uh, for what we're running is about 70 feet um, so that we can run from our power distro and run across um, almost a 40 foot stage. So, um, and it'll give us uh, basically four outlets per box. And also, what we've done on the end of it is we've mounted a um, just a dead end box that has a duplex receptacle on each end so the thing dead ends um, and provides a really nice stage stringer. Um, just a single circuit, um, 20 amp connection, uh, twist lock on the end of it, but um, these boxes from OA Windsor are absolutely perfect for doing stage stringers um, and any other type of um, power that where you need some robust um, mega duty stuff. Um, all, also great for doing um, trade show stringers and things like that. But um, these guys aren't cheap, but they aren't hideously expensive either for what they are. They are going to last us years and years. Um, we've done it with plastic boxes before, and they just um, kind of got banged around and didn't survive real well. So now we're doing it and doing it right and uh, looking for these guys to last us years and years and years. We also um, picked up some spec grade um, receptacles. Uh, from uh, OA Windsor. Um, as you can see with these guys, they've got the wire inserts on the back of them um, that you can go in and do 12-gauge uh, wire inserts and then lock them down. Uh, these are not the cheap push-ins um, that you see at Home Depot or anything, the grounding lug. Um, these are excellent quality, excellent build quality, and being that they're kind of a, a high-end or a spec grade, um, these guys are not going to loosen up over years and years of, um, of use um, and abuse, so to speak. So anyway, um, when you get a hold of Ken at uh, OA Windsor, you can talk to him about supplying these as well. Really good price on those also. The end of our stage stringer is completed with a 20 amp twist lock, as you can see in the picture right here. Um, pretty heavy duty. Um, goes in, clamps down um, on the back of the cable, and provides a really good connection. Um, again, um, we picked up this um, cable. Uh, I think we ended up picking up 150 feet of it on eBay. Um, being 12 gauge, um, very, as I said, very robust. Um, you can probably drive over it, um, roll a cart over it, whatever the case may be, and it's not going to hurt it. Um, so anyway, um, just thought we'd share that with you. And uh, if you look below the video, um, you'll also see the web address for uh, OA Windsor and you can give Ken a call and he will set you up. 